I have got the easiest sheet pan dinner that this might be the recipe that I make the most out of all of my recipes. It is for sheet pan sausage and veggies. I've had shared this recipe before, but the old one had potatoes, so not the most keto friendly. This one is perfect for keto and Whole30. I share my favorite keto friendly sausages that are also Whole30 and this delicious pesto aioli that makes the best dipping sauce for them. I love it so much. I have my rimmed baking sheet. Make sure it's rimmed so the juices don't run off. I lined it with parchment paper just so it'll be really easy cleanup. And I have my veggies here. I'm, I always do bell pepper and onion sliced up that I tossed in olive oil. And then today I'm doing it with broccoli. And this is that gorgeous Italian heirloom broccoli that I get at the farmer's market that is so good. It has like leaves on it that gets really crispy. This is my favorite sausage that I've been using lately. I get it at Costco. I love it because it's both Whole30 and it's keto. A lot of the Whole30 sausages have apple and uh, other like fruit sweeteners in it, but this one, it's just um, such a good ingredient list. Really good and clean, no sweeteners, and it's like so keto friendly. It has like one carb per leg, so it's perfect. One thing about those uh, pepper and basil sausages, they have a plant-based casing, so when you open it, it's kind of like, slimy so some people are weirded out by it but i think it cooks up just fine but it's great if you don't eat pork because it's pork free in the post i have a whole list of my favorite sausages that are whole 30 and keto friendly and the animals like they're organic it's humanely raised animals and they're hormone and antibiotic free so you can read all of them there I've got the sausages on. I always like to put them over the bell pepper and the onion because I feel like it gives them way more flavor and gets them all juicy. And the best part of this meal is I made two. So it's so easy when I'm already chopping, but one will be for dinner tonight for me and Sean and the kids. And then the other one is gonna be meal prep for our lunches for the next week. This is just so fast and time efficient. It's been 15 minutes and I'm gonna give the sausages a flip just so that they um, roast evenly. Here it is out of the oven. It just took 30 minutes and it is all ready to serve up. I have a fresh batch of my homemade mayonnaise and it makes um, one and a quarter cups. So to that, I also have a fresh batch of my homemade pesto that I absolutely love. It's Whole30 and Keto. And I'm just gonna fill it up to an easy way to know that I just do it to the fill line, which would be another quarter cup. Okay, filled up. Now I just have to stir it up. Here it is, all served up. This will be my dinner tonight. And I'm serving it with my pesto aioli, which I showed you guys the other day. I love this because, first of all, it's just it's such a delicious dip. It goes perfect with these sausages. But it's also great to add in tons of extra fat for keto. This is how I pack it up in my favorite meal prep containers so that we have it for lunches for the next two days. So for one super easy night of dinner, I got dinner for tonight and then Sean and I have lunch for the next two days. So amazing. And then I love these little 